My name is Jason Berg. I'm a pro fisherman. I'm watching Press Pass TV. Hey, welcome to Press Pass TV. I'm Morgan Page. Minnesota Viking E.J. Henderson is committed to giving back to the community that he now calls home. He recently opened a pro sports training facility in Minnesota and is raising money to award scholarships to youngsters so they can attend the academy at the facility and also get tutoring on schoolwork while they're there. Follow E.J. through one of his latest fundraisers for this great cause. It's brought to you by our home away from home, the 4040 Club, an upscale sports lounge. Find out more at the4040club.com. What's up, man? It's EJ Henderson, first annual Celebrity Bass Challenge. Nice event in here in R. Normans. My man Dave Cook put it together for us, laid out the spread. So I'm going to walk around and interview a couple of fellas, let y'all meet some of the guys. My first interview is going to be uh, Thomas Tepe over there. Well, um, the biggest thing is I'm from Minnesota, so a lot of people know who I am. Right. Um, I'm getting my foot wet. You know, people already know my name, so by you, me, affiliating with you, with Marion, and you, we're using our name, what we can do is go and get these kids and show them a better way. Something we didn't have as, as we would grow up. Right. And now we have it, it's our, our responsibility to give it back to them. Right. My man John Lobb here from Team Lobb, the man behind the scenes who put all this lovely affair together, put the whole event together tomorrow on Lake Waconia. John Lobb, tell me a little bit about what we going on, got going on here tonight. Well, EJ, as you know, uh, we're having a big star party here. You have a lot of your friends, a lot of celebrities are in town to support your uh, E.J. Henderson Youth Foundation. And we're going to have, uh, we're going to end this in a party tonight. Then we're going to go out in the lake and catch some bass in a professional bass tournament. We got the young one right here, the little one. Formerly one, now 50, Aaron Henderson of the Minnesota Vikings. My young brother, appreciate you coming out today, brother. What do you think the opportunity is? Why, why are you out here today? What's the, what's the cause? The cause is the children, man. That's what it's all about. That's what it all boils down to is, is you know, trying to give back to the community and do something, something beautiful. And I'm very proud of Big Bro for what he's doing right now. And once I take care of what I got to take care of on the field, we're going to make sure that I get involved in this and continue to do good things for the community. Yeah, hopefully we can change it from the E.J. Henderson Youth Foundation to just the Henderson. You Foundation, the Henderson You Foundation. I just want to thank everybody for coming out. Uh, this is our first real fundraiser. Uh, definitely thank Dave Cook and Art Normans for, for letting us have this nice event in here, laying out the food for us, putting on this nice venue. Uh, thanks for all the sponsors for coming out, supporting the foundation. Like I said, this is our first real fundraiser. This will be the push to put us over the top, get us flowing in the right direction for the start of this upcoming year. Uh, we're going to have a nice event tomorrow. Hopefully we can come out and have a nice tournament. Uh, we got some more boats that still need to be purchased, about five more boats. Any sponsors who want to volunteer, $2,500. Get to ride on the boat with a celebrity and a pro angler. Uh, real fishing tournament. Everybody have a good time tonight. Be safe, and we'll see y'all tomorrow morning. Press Pass TV, I'm Jack Brewer here with Lance Johnstone, 11-year NFL veteran. A uh, good friend of mine, Lance, you come out. You come out a lot, you support all types of charities. Tell us a little bit about why do you travel so far? What What is it about EJ Henderson and this event that made you come out tonight? I, I've been to EJ's uh, facility, seen a lot of things they do over there um, and what they're trying to build. So I, I've been behind it since day one. Zach, what do events like this mean to you? Well, you know, when you give it back to community and you give it back to kids and for a great cause, it's always a positive. You know, because you're coming back, you know, you're raising money, and you know you, you know you're gonna do something positive with it. So you don't have to go up and you don't have to be a positive. This is a shining a light on something that's good in the community, not something that's bad always. But we always shine in the media saying guys doing this wrong, guys doing that wrong, but this guy is doing something good. You know, and when you're doing something good, this is the time you can show the light and show what guys are doing. We're back here on Press Pass TV, and here we're, we're here with Vikings head coach Brad Childress, and I just want you to talk about why you came out tonight and uh, what you know about the foundation. Well, first of all, I want to support EJ. I'm not much of a fisherman, but this isn't really fishing. I don't have to put a line in the water anywhere. Um, but I know he just does so many good things around this city, around Minneapolis. And this is part of it. This is part of a fundraising event, and uh, I just want to support him. And I'm standing here with the man of the evening, E.J. Henderson. And I just, I just want to ask a little bit about the foundation and what the cause is and, you know, why everybody came out tonight. The cause is definitely for the urban youth, Minneapolis, St. Paul. 
you know, we try to get those kids and bring them out to the to the urban area of Eden Prairie. I got a training facility out there called Game Speed Training Facility. So we bust the kids out. They come there, they get to train with all the pro athletes, all the suburban kids. They go through academic training park, life skills lounge. They go in for about 30 minutes in each one, get a lesson, and they get to come out and work out. So that's what this is all about. You know, we raise the money so we can pay the vendors to get those kids in there running through the program. Hopefully we get the program running by September. I hope you enjoyed that segment, and to see more behind-the-scenes action, check out our site at PressPass.tv or our YouTube page at YouTube.com slash PressPass. Also, don't forget to check out our live and podcast radio shows at PressPassRadio.com, and keep the feedback coming in to mail at PressPassTV.com. I'm Morgan Page. Thanks for watching. Bye.